Mm, hello, everybody. Welcome to Global Peace by 2027. This is Global Prayer Chain. So nice to meet you. So happy to see you. And uh, as we start the new year in a few hours, <laughs> some of you already passed. There was a uh, Tinku from uh, India. Uh, new year, maybe already. <laughs> Uh, okay, we do pray a 40 day prayer condition already. The eighth one, we pray for peace in Eastern Europe and uh, immediate peace and the uh, ultimate global peace by 2027. So, uh, uh, usually we do read some powerful quote from the size and coming to get inspiration okay and let's uh, go with the court ladies and gentlemen with the arrival of new millennium at midnight of new year eve i proclaim a message for the new year entitled the cosmic expansion of true love is the competition of the new millennium kingdom cosmic expansion of true love means that heaven and earth must became a house of true love new the new millennium is time when we complete the building of god's kingdom throughout the world since uh, the cosmos originated from god families tribe people nations and the world have to work to complete this house of love which is stands as a partner to god then they, they can do this by each establishing uh, their own houses of love according to principle formula by and by becoming one with each other nations need to be houses of love where all families can enter and the cosmos needs to be a house of love that embraces the world the family of true love is particularly important because it is the core of the cosmos which is our enormous uh, house in the kingdom of heaven Within the family, the husband is the house of love for his wife, and the wife is the house of love for her husband. The parents are the house of love for their children, and the children are the house of love for their parents. Okay, this is uh, the quote for today. So nice to see you, everybody, in this uh, great year. Uh, <laughs> let's start our global prayer chain. Uh, I would like to ask uh, Tinku, are you? In India already, you celebrate New Year, or uh, is not yet? Yes, sir. Uh, is New Year already? Is twelve o'clock midnight in India, or what time is now? Oh, uh, after two hours, celebration will be started. Ah, okay. In uh, wow. twelve p.m. <laughs> Good. <laughs> okay, so let's invite Irina to pray, and then I invite you, Tinku, to say a powerful speech. <laughs> Something here, inspiration for this. Yeah, Erina, welcome. Thank you. So, are we continue? Are we praying for family again today, or we have a new program? Yeah, let's pray for New Year. <laughs> As is uh, like New Year celebration. Okay. Just on the light, you see, I have some light here. <laughs> I took from my daughter, you know, okay. some modern. <laughs> Okay, okay. Yeah, let us pray. Good evening, our most precious heavenly cosmic parent and our dearest beloved true parents of heaven and earth and all humankind. We greet you, all the saints and sages of this world. Today, we are very grateful to be able to end the year 2022. It was not a very easy year because many countries are still suffering from the effects of COVID. And even other countries, COVID is still disturbing them. Then we had the war in Eastern Europe, which shook the whole world and it is still going on and it has affected the whole world in terms of the standard of living prices going so high. But we are very grateful, Heavenly Parents, 
because even through the troubles, the worldwide troubles, you were with us throughout the year. We went through all our prayer conditions and we are very grateful for that. And we still want to pray, especially to bring peace on earth by the year 2027. As we read today, everything depends on the family the children, their love for parents, the parents, their love for children, and the whole family, their love for God. A family that promotes moral values, a family where parents teach their children and prepare them for the future generation. Today, heavenly parents, we had the regional African regional end of your prayers. And the theme was new beginning. And in a new beginning, there was emphasis on how we can prepare our future generation to take over leadership of the world. So we are really very grateful, Father, for today's reading, which reminds us that many things are done in the family and from the family to the society, and then to the whole world. So I want to continue also to pray for families, and especially those families who are troubled with war. They are separated, father, husbands and wives are not together, and children, some of them, because of the guns and bombs, they don't know where their relatives are. It's so bad, heavenly parent. We really need to quickly bring peace on earth. I want to thank you, heavenly parents, for keeping this world calm and contented, Father. Even though, Father, many countries are suffering from health problems, they are suffering from food, lack of food, from corruption politically, and many others. But here we are, we are ending the year, and we want to start from tonight, a new beginning of hope, love, and togetherness, living for the sake of others, promoting peace, bringing unity, and above all, building strong families. Thank you so much, our dearest heavenly parents, our dearest true parents. I want to really thank you gratefully and making us learn how to live gratefully. I want to pray in the holy names of Jesus Christ, of our beloved true parents, as Ellen Altanje of the Blessed Central Family, Adieu, adieu, amen, amen. Thank you very much, Irina. So good to hear from you, powerful prayer. We could hear you, mother and grandmother heart for the world. <laughs> Thank you very Thank much. You. Let's invite Thank the Tinku. He usually have a very good, powerful uh, research about peace. Tinku from India, welcome. Welcome. So first of all, we wish you a very happy new year for all of you and uh, holy services to humanity in the fields of health, education, population, pollution, control and natural calamities. A philosophy of peace which believes that dharma accepts life in its entirety. The true religion is working towards getting rid of any physical or mental suffering. Service is not a separate from a spirituality. Service is a spirituality. I start talking about peace. Religion is an inward step, but if a religion remains attached to one group or other, so that unfortunate, only the struggle has come. 
I present the meaning of religion has become to join the group. This is what religion is making people do. Its aim is to make people deities. This is what religion is making people do. Each, if a natural reaction in you all an innate habit of a human being, once you join a particular group, you become a threat to others. Of course, everybody bonds to peace, nobody bonds to conflict. So why can't we talk about peace? It's time to let's talk about it today. If we must start talking about it, then this situation can change. If you don't have the courage to talk about it, you will leave this world forever in this condition. The only legion, Jesus was crucified by, by because he dared to speak about it. It needs to continuous improvements. Only one Jesus, one Buddha, and one Mahatma Gandhi will not work. Many such people are needed that only there will be a possibility for this world otherwise. It will continue to become extremist. I am happy that it is emerging as the fastest growing economy. With the help of AI, bulk class infrastructure, with the excellent connectivity, rail, air network, as well as largest banks available for industries. So better law and order and investment friendly policies have attracted entrepreneurs from India and abroad. The part is definitely found by the advice of people, but success comes from one's own hard work and dedications. So whatever work we are doing that responsibility has been given to us by God. I congratulate the glorious centenary at the feet of God due to in which the feeling of peace in which life toward value was contained. He said one thing which is always remembers. So thank you so much. Have a nice day. Beautiful coming New Year's. Aju Amin Amin. Yeah, thank you very much, dear Tinku. <laughs> yeah, interreligious for peace. <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's invite uh, Regis from uh, Burundi. Welcome. Please say a powerful prayer for peace. Something gratitude for God for last year and something for New Year. <laughs> thank you. Thank you for joining in prayer. Uh, I will not start. I will not uh, start that without wishing you, wishing you a happy new year for everybody here. So thank you. Join me in prayer. Our dearest heavenly parent, most beloved true parent of heaven and and all your mankind, beloved uh, Jesus Christ, sent and sages. We are very grateful for this wonderful moment that we got again for a higher purpose, for your idea, the idea of peace. Every parent, we know that you are looking for your children, children that have been ignorant. Humanity have been come ignorant of the right way to find eternal and lasting peace. But heavenly parent, by the values that has been revealed by the Lord's true parent, that they are calling out each and everybody to follow the value of interdependence, mutual prosperity, and the universal shared values, thing that no one has known in its deepest. So every parent to beg that as we are finishing this year, entering a new year, more people can come to know these values in their fullness. So Father, people have been talking about peace, people have been advocating for peace, but they are far from knowing the really, the really way, the right way to follow peace. And the right way comes only from you. And as the Bible say, there is to know God and the work and the path of righteousness. We pray for peace around the world. 
in the Middle East, in uh, America, in Asia, in Africa, all the corners of the world. And we beg and pray that uh, your father, the awareness of the existence, the truth the, of the real uh, uh, God, who is a, a parent, who is our father, father can dwell and be in every every human being living on earth. And once we come to know the real father, after we come to know the real God, once we come to know the truth, it will be easy for father. Yeah, that is coming. Great thing is going to happen, the providence, as a true parent are preparing for a great uh, event. So for this, let this good event bring, bring the knowledge of God, the knowledge of truth for all the seven point uh, something billion of uh, human beings on this earth. This is, uh, Father, your will. This is your wish. This is your desire. And we pray for it that this will happen. Father, let's uh, look at those who are uh, being, Father, uh, are squatted because of war, those are suffering because of lack of peace. Father, we beg, Father, that by the next year, Father, peace can reign. All those who are in the position for looking, helping peace to come, lasting peace, Father, we pray for, Father, the knowledge, the real and, the, and the, the true knowledge, adequate knowledge from you can, Father, be with them. And this is nowhere to find done fighting, finding, Father, and following, Father, the path of righteousness. Uh, Father, we are happy. Uh, peacemakers, please do the court, the sons, and pray this with my whole heart and uh, with the, the conviction that by next year, great things will happen. Peace. And this I pray with a grateful heart in the name of uh, the Father, in the name of the Christ, in the name of our uh, our beloved heavenly parent and true parent, and in uh, our names, Aju. Aju, amen. Aju, amen, amen. Amen, amen. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you. So good <laughs> to hear from uh, Burundi. Uh, yes, uh, as we are working in this uh, global uh, um, meeting you i sent you the video what we was doing 2022 it just is a short report i don't have reports from every country but i send it i i do i made a video a video there is attached also we will work in 2023 further and with the leaders and the appointing peace ambassadors and society uh community community leaders and also there we have social service, charities, uh, pro program, programs for families. Uh, uh, about business, we also, uh, there is uh, many opportunity for investments and uh, we will try to develop, uh, as I myself, I said that we could do any time the um, uh, webinar, how we could make money online or offline because I, I'm this uh, coach on business. And uh, then uh, fourth one, we work on the, media, culture, and arts for peace. Uh, we, was, um, we have in this uh, uh, channel and uh, YouTube, and I have every day their uh, um, powerful message for the day, something like to make a goal and uh, some inspirations. Um, a fifth, uh, we work for school, universities, and uh, I'm very happy that uh, I was working with uh, Rina and uh, we could uh, give a pure love uh, online uh, presentation for her school and um, we supposed to continue next year and about we have many volunteer programs and for youth and uh, there are other peace ambassadors work and the uh, sports and others and uh, also interface we have this meeting every evening we pray for peace to mobilize heavenly world uh, for world peace Okay, so this is uh, seven areas where we work in Global Peace Network and uh, we expand. The, for now, we have 100 country ambassadors and uh, just is developing. Some of them work, uh, uh, how to say, more quickly, some not so, <laughs> but uh, it's good to cooperate with anybody. There's the Uniting the People Organization for Ultimate Global Peace by 2027, not just pray. Because uh, uh, their ambassadors, they are doing their uh, work on the field. 
Uh, and uh, so inspired that uh, maybe we will continue with the, um, uh, how to say, uh, in the new countries like in Uganda, uh, Burundi, maybe we could do some family festivals, <laughs> rededication marriages, and uh, let's see <laughs> what God prepared for. Of course, uh, like there was Corona and there came war and other crazy things, uh, how to say, um, um, but um, God providence, you couldn't stop. Mm -hmm. Okay, so please join my prayer. I, I want to say a short prayer uh, because I also have to say God meet us <laughs> in the different yeah, corner please. of the world. <laughs> okay. Uh, dear Heavenly Parents, we are so happy to meet you alive here. We really could feel you and hear you from our brothers and sisters globally. And I pray for families to join here. I pray for the... Uh, Erina and her family in Uganda, and Regis and her, his family in, in uh, Burundi, uh, all of them in Heavenly Africa, and the Tinku in uh, India, family Asia. And I'm in Europe, uh, dear Heavenly Parents, uh, we are so happy, really happy, not just because we are happy, but uh, because we meet you, and you meet us, and you invite us, and uh, we understand that um, we make so many challenges, but uh, there is a hope, and uh, this hope is Messiah's and coming. And uh, even there are many challenges, uh, as we discussed uh, above uh, in the world, uh, but uh, Messiah's coming did in the beginning of the 2022 a great summit for peace. And where was uniting political leaders and other leaders who was usually fighting, but now they was working for peace. And there is another upcoming summit uh, that Messiah is organizing and also a great uh, uh, sanctuary opening, a great temple that is, is open in the east where uh, you could reign forever, dear Heavenly Parent. And uh, this uh, we want to invest our heart and uh, pass it to all future generations. Uh, everybody could give a hand uh, for this. Uh, dear Heavenly Parent, uh, we really are happy to um, live with the Messiah in this golden age. And uh, we want to share this happiness with all other brothers and sisters. And uh, it's so nice that uh, we could celebrate together with you New Year and uh, put new goals uh, set up and uh, uh, attain them. As a heavenly parent, uh, we understand that uh, we are very humble and uh, if we just go with our human uh, efforts alone, uh, alone or uh, with the collective, um, we could do just maximum 5% as was in the history, but you was doing 95% another one. So we want to connect together and use all our full potential uh, to help others, to love others, to work in our families and raise our kids and the uh, grandchildren and uh, all of them in true love because you plan this uh, earth to be an uh, earth full of true love. Let's stop the words and we pray for all uh, that you could uh, send the, the visions and dreams to all brothers and sisters who are fighting to really stop them immediately in Eastern Europe and globally by 2027, that we could um, um, make from the weapons luxuries as was prophesied. And the 2023 could do it, at least start it. <laughs> Dear Heavenly Parents, uh, we are really happy to meet you alive. And uh, I pray very much for those families who join offline. Um, there are many families who join uh, at seven o'clock their own time, and thus we are doing a circle around uh, the globe. Uh, so we pray very much for all eight billion plus people for to for them to for sal their salvation, blessing, and healing, and the uh, peace, dear heavenly parents. Please uh, lead them, all of us, because we are all your children. We know it or know, don't know, but you are around us and you are in us, as Messiah said, and we want to feel you and hear you. Thank you very much for this year, 2022. We bring it uh, as a pure offering this 31st of uh, December, 2022. And uh, uh, let's plan uh, the 1st of January and all 2023 and further with a great hope from you. Please receive this short report. I pray in my name as Nikolai Kerpala, Santa Plus family. Adieu, amen, amen, amen. Adieu, adieu, amen. Amen, adieu, 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 amen. Yeah, thank you very much to, uh, so thankful for you, Irina and uh, Regis and uh, Tinku that uh, you was all year together. Have a blessed <laughs> 2023. <laughs>
Ya que 